Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. In apparent medical emergency. It's been now a few weeks um, that our patients have not been able to access supplemental oxygen for home discharge at Guam Memorial. Oxygen provided by home concentrators, a machine that gives the breathing assistance needed for them to survive. We're treating patients with emphysema, with asthma, with lung diseases that require them to have oxygen at home. Uh, as of yesterday, the major suppliers on island had informed us is that they were out. Some are even left admitted at GMH because the private companies are out. There's a lot of frustration. Uh, patients want to go home. There's actually been a shortage for several weeks and an apparent growing demand for people needing it as well. I found out of the, about this simply by speaking to the home nursing group mm -hmm. uh, who does the majority of our referrals, particularly for people who have lung cancer or who are what, on what's called hospice, um, basically end of life care. So what we're talking about is the increased need for these kinds of things for our people on island and now the sudden um, uh, absence of it or shortage of it and really there's been no notification. GMH confirms they do have an adequate oxygen supply at the hospital. There's also the capability for patients to have these portable oxygen tanks. The issue is they last on average four to five hours. That's why they need the concentrators for around the clock care at home. I'm here to tell you that it's a big problem because the patients that we're trying to uh, keep comfortable, um, keep, keep them out of the hospital yeah. right now don't have that uh, we don't have that ability, and so the hospital is about to see a lot more sick people. KUAM reached out to the handful of companies that provided the devices, all aware of the shortage, telling us they just don't have enough to meet the growing demand on island. A couple of businesses have since ordered additional concentrators. Until then, patients are left with very limited options to survive. It's really um, a difficult situation for them because they don't want to be in the hospital, especially because they don't need to be in the hospital. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.